Go ahead. Okay. Uh, my name is Robert Estrada, and uh, I was scheduled last November 21st to go in for a total knee replacement. I've been having trouble with my knees, or my right knee, for uh, forever, for quite a few years, and the pain level was was such that I was already willing to have a total knee replacement. I was told that I was bone on bone. Uh, I point blank asked uh, several uh, orthopedic surgeons if it was possible for the body to regenerate uh, the cartilage, and they told me absolutely not. You have to have a knee replacement now. Uh, after seeing Dr. Bergman, he did a workup on me and said, "You're not bone on bone. If you if you were, you wouldn't be walking as you are, and we can get you well." Uh, he did a full workup on me, and he showed me. It's the first one that ever took an x-ray of both knees together. And he, he said, I took this x-ray for you, not for me. I already know one. Uh, tell me which one was the bad one. They both looked as bad. He said, I'm not going to tell you that uh, your, your uh, cartilage is not thin. It is. But you're going to regenerate that cartilage, and I'm going to prove it to you. He said, well, now let me show you your spine. And that's where the problem was. That was the source of it. And uh, I think that uh, he, he's right. I've done other work with other people that have kind of pointed that out that I was a little bit twisted up there and making me walk incorrectly. I had another clinic tell me one time, so you can get a um, knee replacement if you want, but it'll probably be, what, I don't care if it's made out of titanium, uh, ceramic, or whatever, uh, it's probably going to last you maybe 10 years, and you have to do it again by the way you're walking. And, well, what do you mean? And I had just some alignment issues, shall we say. And uh, coming over to seeing uh, the Bergman family uh, chiropractic has really made great inroads. I haven't taken as much as an aspirin for what now, almost five months now. And I was, he asked me, are you taking an anti-inflammatory? I told him, yeah, kind of like popcorn. He goes, you know it's bad for you. Yeah, I know the liver. It's killing the liver and the kidneys and all that. What's a good alternative? He gave me good alternatives on that. What he gave me was a plan that was like a triad of uh, uh, constant chiropractic adjustments and care, exercise. He gave me certain exercises to do, which I do religiously, and diet. And he told me, I want to work you, wean you away from an acid diet and get you more alkaline, which is helping the body heal itself. And what I learned here was that he said, if the body has like 30 trillion cells, and over the course of about 14 months, they all at varying rates, they regenerate themselves, and a, a broken bone can heal itself in six weeks, you don't think the body knows how to heal itself? You know, anybody, anybody tells you that you're bone on bone, you need a total knee replacement, like telling you the, the world is flat. So, um, so you don't need I, surgery anymore? I, I don't need surgery anymore. The pain level is just gone. Uh, every once in a while, I might have a little bit of a, of a you know, during the weather or, or whatever, with barometric uh, changes. But I've got these exercises that uh, I was given to do, and it helps that. And I, I'm taking some of the uh, fish oils and all that, and it uh, it's all worked out very well, well. And no surgery. All of this has taken place in only three months. So I'm really looking forward to the rest of my life now. And I have something else too, is one of the things that uh, I've told friends about and they get concerned about, oh, well, insurance cover this and that. My question to them is always, what is your pain worth to you? That's something to consider because I'm healing.